So, Coral has leaked and rather giving us brand new information about the highly anticipated Pokemon Sword and Shield games for the Nintendo Switch. It gives us some regurgitated information about the Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution movie, which is due out in Japan later this year. What is up, guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred, and in today's video, we're going to be discussing Armored Mewtwo. Will it make his appearance in Pokemon Sword and Shield? Yeah, let's let, let's get into that. So, first of all, I want to start off today's video by just giving a shout out to Serbi.net. This is where most of my information is going to be sourced back to. So, of course, links to the site, the Twitter, the YouTube, and the IG are going to be in the description below. So, let's jump right over to Serbi.net and check out what the official announcement about these leaked images were. It says, Pokemon Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution. Okay. Korokoro has revealed some further information about the Mewtwo. To Strikes Back Evolution. In addition to reiterating information regarding the armored Mewtwo as seen in previous trailer, it also mentions that if you go to see the movie in Japan, you will get a new reprint of the ancient Mew promotional card which was released back in 1999 in conjunction with the second movie just to get it out the way very quickly oh my god they're reprinting the ancient Mew card that's epic as a kid I thought this was the greatest thing on earth for some reason I thought it was one of the most strongest card in the Pokemon trading card game and obviously it wasn't but to me it was the greatest thing. So it's great that this generation of kids and moviegoers will have a chance to get their hands on this dope collectible and kind of relive what we relived when we first seen the movie. If you were one of those people who saw the movie and got yourself that ancient Mew card. So now with my nostalgia trip out of the way, let's jump back into the meat and potatoes of this video. Being that everyone is thinking or speculating that because they are focusing on the armored Mewtwo in the Mewtwo Strikes Back evolution movie and Coral Coral is running this whole spread on Armored Mewtwo that this movie is going to have some kind of a connection to Pokemon on the Nintendo Switch Pokemon Sword and Shield games and sorry to be the one to break this to you if you didn't realize it yet but those dreams are gone those dreams should not exist because of the obvious reason that this is a remake of that Mewtwo Strikes Back movie. And in that movie, it didn't have any connection to the games at all back then. So why would it have a connection to the games back now? And then on top of that, what we've seen from the trailers, they're not even adding Gen 2, Gen 3, Gen 4 Pokemon to this movie, besides Togepi. But everything that is shown off so far has been identical to the main original movie to the original content why again will we have a connection to pokemon sword and shield where the the movie doesn't even look like it has a connection to us in 2019 as far as updating and like having incineroar or you know lit in, in the movie or something like that to connect it but like hey gen 7 is here you know gen 8 gen 6 is here gen 5 is here. like there's no connection at all that showcase that in the trailers i doubt that connection will be shown in the movie but again just to Another needle in the coffin. Jumping back to Cerebi.net, it says Pokemon Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution. We have some further translations from this month's issue of Coral Coral magazine pertaining to the movie. For a while, many have speculated that the armored Mewtwo could be a springboard into new game content. However, with Coral Coral's showcase of Armored Mewtwo, it reconfirms that the Armored is designed to suppress Mewtwo's strength, much like the armor in the original movie. In addition to that, it states outright that this appearance of Mewtwo is exclusive to the movie. Although, it will of course appear in merchandise and other promotional elements for the movie. We will provide further details on the movie as they come. Now, wow, it clearly says that this appearance of Mewtwo is exclusive to the movie. Again, with that translation, it could sound like they trying to say that, again, this is just my thoughts of the translation, that the CGI armored Mewtwo model that they're showcasing in these images is for the movie which still leaves room for Game Freak to create a model for Armored Mewtwo for the games. Again, that's something I highly doubt, but I think that's where everyone is kind of pulling their, their imagination from, their thoughts from anyway. Again, something I highly doubt. See, the Mewtwo has the armored on in the original movie, 
because the scientists, again, who were working to create Mewtwo and all this stuff in the lab, they wanted to control and suppress Mewtwo's power. Why would we get a feature based around this in the new games that suppresses legendary Pokemon's power. It just doesn't make sense to me. It's not something that's adding or increasing the Pokemon's power like Mega Evolutions do. It's something that, again, is suppressing the power. So why would they focus? No, like why? why? Again, why? To me, a lot of people are just trying to convince themselves that all of these armored evolution rumors are true. And to be honest, while it does sound dope on paper, until the Pokemon company comes out and says that armor evolutions are a thing and that they're putting armor evolutions in the game, it isn't real. We shouldn't be sitting here. Well, you could be sitting here speculating and having your thoughts and opinions on it. But again, it's like, why? It's, it's, it's not. No. Like, it's, no. <laughs> it, let, let them announce it first. Let, let us speculate and talk about stuff that we have connections to, stuff that we can scratch and stuff that is more real that we could pull from from actual information that they're giving us not something that's coming out of a movie art also i see people zooming in on this image from the coral coral page and saying this isn't from the movie this is from pokemon sword and shield and well no 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 again this is clearly from the movie they state this that all of these images are from the movie. People are saying that, you know, this looks like a trainer battle. And I gotta say, no, it looks like a, a trainer battle is going on. Yeah, it looks straight out of the scene where Armor Mewtwo is fighting inside of Giovanni's gym or training with Giovanni inside of the original movie. Like this is something that we've seen already. Mewtwo standing in a quote unquote gym battlefield, a, you know, a player battlefield. We've seen him standing in that with the armor on, so I wouldn't speculate that this is from the game as well. And again, I don't want to sound like I'm pooping on someone's parade or anyone in particular, you watching this video and you're like, oh my God, he's just, you know, shitting on the idea. Nah, I'm not, I didn't create this video to do that. I just wanted to, again, showcase my idea, my thoughts, my theories on whether we were going to get armored me to inside a pokemon sword and shield and obviously i think the answer is no look i'm all for armored evolutions inside pokemon sword and shield especially if they look anything like this charizard and this is deviant art this is fake but as of today we don't have any evidence that says that is real or that is coming to the games let me know what you guys think about armored mewtwo or armored evolutions in the comment section below peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one like always guys i'm daddy gamer fred on instagram and twitter and you guys can bring the conversation there i'm the american gamer in switzerland right here on youtube and yes i'm gonna be doing a ton of videos just like this one so if you enjoy please hit that subscribe button also hit the like button it does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video peace i'm gonna see you guys on the next one